Fleeing Outworld, I hadn't expected to return. But then I also hadn't expected the new Empress to make me an offer I couldn't refuse. To thank me for helping stop General Shao's rebellion, she asked me to be her emissary to the Zaterans. Going home. Bearing the seal of the royal house, I would show once and for all, that my mutation wasn't to be feared. That it wasn't a source of shame. To my surprise, I was welcomed. But those warm smiles hid a dark secret. I stumbled upon a trove of official records which showed that my shape-shifting ability isn't unique. Many Saterans are born with it, but are killed by their government to keep it from spreading. Who started this barbaric policy? Who is now enforcing it is unknown. But I will find out. And I will put an end to this madness. Scorpion. Yeah! <laughs> 
From nothing comes all. Round two, fight. Ah! <laughs> 
Round two, fight. <laughs> by Empress Melina, I joined Havoc's Crusade in Saido. There, I summoned more magic than I thought possible, and drowned out the old regime. Havoc's longed-for anarchy had been achieved. He was more than satisfied. But I was left empty and broken. Satisfied as Outworld's high mage, not let myself be tempted by Shang Tsung, a great city would not now lay in ruins. I've caused devastation, ended thousands of lives, all because of my blind ambition. I've betrayed my oath, my sovereign, and my realm. These high crimes merit punishment, and I'll accept whatever the Empress gives me. My only ambition now is to one day be forgiven.